Hey there, everybody. Magnum Knights here with Fallout 4. Alright. Start up a new game here. Let's get rocking. Alright, I have been waiting for this for such a long time. I am so looking forward to Fallout 4. It is not even comprehensible how much I've wanted this. Fallout 3 was good. Don't get me wrong, I liked Fallout 3. Obsidian did New Vegas better. Now I want to see what Bethesda has done with Fallout 4 to improve upon their mistakes with Fallout 3. War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. I am so digging that opening video. That was fucking perfect, I have to say. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Hey, my turn, big guy. Alright. Let's take a look see here. You can just not right change face. Yeah, D goes back and forth on the faces. Okay. Alright, we'll work on this. Highlight facial features and press this one to make adjustments. Okay. So you can click and hold. Make different adjustments. Cool. Such a cute nose. Or I can hit T, and we could just change it on its own. All right. I think Sean has my eyes.
You do know you've got the most beautiful eyes I've ever seen. Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> the suspicious eyes. <laughs> Such pretty eyes. Okay, so I can just hit S to sculpt. Not sure exactly what I do here. Right, I'll just accept oh, that yeah. for now. Yeah, that works. New hairstyle? I love it. Am I going colorblind? Does that look red to you people? Yeah, it might just be the light. Let's go with I have the best hairdresser, I swear. All right, that's enough time in character creator. Rock and roll. Hey, hun. I'll just be a minute. Fully voiced character. Very nice, Bethesda. Very nice. All right, I'm gonna start my uh, timer here. There now. Make sure I don't, you know, make these four hour long episodes of me just running around playing Fallout. So nobody watches those. We really need to get those vacation photos developed. No need to get dressed twice. Just bits and bobs in there. Hmm. Glove's a little big now, but Sean will grow into it. Should get this signed next time we're at the park. Can't wait to teach him to ride this. <laughs> He'll either be great at spelling or great at smashing blocks together. <laughs> to think, one day he's gonna learn how to drive. Holy shit, it's the special book. Here we go. Wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Right, apparently there's a kid. Hmm. Can I take anything out of here? Uh, nope. Let Codsworth take care of it. Another fine product of General Atomics International. The Braxo for all your cleaning needs. Sugar bombs. A hundred percent daily value of sugar. Grognak the Barbarian and the Jungle of the Bat Babies. <laughs> it's a little early to be drinking. Says you. Now who left those here? How can someone so small drink so much? Saddle up Salisbury steak. Rated A+. Plus. Looks like the milk got delivered. Like New Coca-Cola. Ice cold. <laughs> I know we were nervous at first, but I'm glad we got Codsworth. Me too. Robot slaves are always worth it. A lot of late nights. It was worth it. Yeah. Juris Doctorate. Very nice. Good old U.S. of A. <sighs> Never gonna find that dog. Oh, I lost my doggy. <sighs> More of the same. 
that salesman again. I don't know why he keeps bothering you. Good morning! vault calling! No offense, but no soliciting. Oh, no worries, ma'am. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not today. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No. Oh. <clears throat> you do. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being, um... <laughs> A precious I wonder commodity. if I can get this guy I'm here to today go away. To tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. But I have a family. You can fit us all, right? Of course, of course. Miner's your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. Of course. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. The apocalypse? Well, hell, sign me up. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. Now, let's see. Okay, here we go. Uh, name. Okay, we got 21 points to work with. That's not a lot of points. Effects number of XP earned. Okay. Overall fitness and reflexes. Action points and vats. Sneak. Critical hit. Persuade and dialogue and prices. You lose health from sprinting? I had sense bad grammar in there. This weapon accuracy in bats. How much you can carry. Alright. Let's go with the huge XP boost. And better prices. Uh, get some HP. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Wow, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second. The Mr. Handybot looks amazing. Oh, how'd you get on the floor, Mr. Bear? My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? <laughs> That's my boy, on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. <laughs> Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. The seven-second war. We need to get to the vault. Now! 
got shot. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Hold on, little guy. That was a that's an enclave vertebrate. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, you sir. You two, follow me. God Come on. Us What's going to happen to all those people outside We're doing the gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Ma'am, we need to send you down to the vault. Step on the platform. Step on the platform in the center. Almost there. Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! <laughs> That's a little close. You guys should kind of be fried. And blind. in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes. Up... Hey there. Up the stairs. A minute later. No, no, we don't. Don't get caught up thinking about that. Tech You're is here for you. Just All this way, please. please. This way. Female. This way, please. Good. Step over to the table and take a seat. You'll need your suits before we can take you further. Thanks. Pick up a suit what now? There. Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. Hey. See? <laughs> Everything okay? This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My mother and father down in DC. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a good fit, don't you think? Just checking Bald everyone off designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely day. Hey! Just this way. Just Wait a second. And put your vault suit on. Wait a second. These look like the thing from Fallout 3, where everybody was just... Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There she is, see? Mommy's not going far. All set. Just step inside and put on your vault suit. Decontamination pod my foot. It's gonna suck my brain, isn't it? And put me in some kind of weird digital world. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In. Cryostasis, you bastards. You rat bastards, you froze me. I fucking knew it.
going on? You rat bastard. Oh, that's not cool. Bald man, scar over eye. Oh yeah, I'm gonna remember you. You're gonna get it first. Or possibly last. Depending on where the plot line takes me. Or just my random travels in the wastes. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Oh, God. Why would Vault Tech do this? Why would Vault Tech do this? <laughs> well, those of us that play a lot of the Fallout games, we know exactly why Vault Tech did this. It's because war was inevitable, and they were planning on, you know, having a whole bunch of experiments done on unwitting people for deep space exploration. Freezing does not work. Why did they do this? I'm kind of looking to see if, you know, Philip J. Fry is in here somewhere. Why? Why did they do this? Alright, we got ye old ham fists. <coughs> Some tools here. Take these. Brad Roaches. Good to see some things never change. Step back. Security terminal. I'll take that. Uh, last entry. Right. Apparently there was a mutiny of some kind. Cryogenic array. All residents must vacate immediately. Not sending me in empty handed, at least. Let's go, Baton. <sighs> Giant roaches. What the hell? blocking just hit the damn things what happened here somebody with a vault suit Where got out everyone? all right so not everybody that was cryogenically frozen was frozen as long as my character was <laughs> left alt to power attack okay so it's no longer just hold the button 
Lost impacts. Thank you. Hello, Lucy. Is this all that's left? Some smokes, that's kind of nice. Uh, what have we got in here? Bullets. Bullets are always useful. Nothing in these dressers. Uh, hello, other Lucy. Unlocked Master Lock. What is that in there? Hello, Muriel. Nice. Coming oh. back later for you. Second 10 millimeter pistol. All right. More bullets. It's a lot of bullets. That's good. Uh, do a bottle and a pencil. Sure. We'll need some starter caps. Is anyone alive? Did anyone get out? Let's take a look at this terminal. Uh, we'll open up the evacuation tunnel. Okay. Designed to test long-term effects of suspended animation on unaware human subjects. Short-term assignment to monitor basic cardiopulmonary cognitive functions, long-term monitoring can be handled remotely by vault deck. Suspension. This includes the administration of life-saving measures. <laughs> Just let them die in the pod. Holy shit. Go vault deck. Faster than your average roach right there. Might have to dial up the uh, aim sensitivity. Punish the bullets I just wasted there. More bullets! <laughs> exactly what the doctor ordered. Okay, nothing out here. Guess we could put the gun away for now. Hello, friend. There you are. Been a while. Screen's dusty. 64k of RAM. You're never gonna live that down, Bill Gates. Never, ever, ever. Okay, so I've taken a little bit of damage. Almost leveled. Uh, I guess this is my defensive measures. Is I have five defense against damage and ten against radiation. My legs that have been damaged a little bit. I have 90 AP. That's my stat points, okay. I have no perks. Uh, I don't see a repair option anymore. I see an inspect. Okay, so I can inspect my baton. Okay. Current mods. Interesting. It's fiery. Interesting. That's kind of cool. Alright. 
Got a couple of vault suits. If I click on one, yeah, okay, I change into it. Cycle damage. Aid. Okay, I've got some rad road for meat. So if I inspect this, well, okay. It'll give me 11 rads. It's worth 15 HP to eat. 30% of HP, alright. Instant packs are just percentage based now. Junk. <laughs> Alright, no radio stations yet. Boy down. Vault door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. games. Alright. Oh, I could change my appearance here, but... Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. No, thank you. Alright, I'm gonna wrap it up here with the finishing of the tutorial. This is Magnum Knight saying, see you guys in the next one.